It's just cool. It's We want to bat first. So it is Gin and Brescia that have won the toss and elected to bat here in the final. Big toss to win. I know that Roma CC don't mind chasing. They've actually chased pretty well, especially on finals day. And it's been played away nicely. Good bit of timing, finds the gap. This is all about the length of the delivery. Just a tad short from Rathanaikas. And that Nawaz, he just waits for it. He knows exactly what he wants to do with it. Puts it through the gap. Four runs. Slow delivery. There is an edge here. There is a definite edge. It goes down. Oh, he decides to go with the bounce. And it works beautifully. Well, that one is out of here. Maximal. This one's a little bit short. Turn around the corner, long chase, and uh, it's going to be an unsuccessful chase for Roma CC. Out swing up, this will be four as well. Gets it wrong, gets the ball to move a bit, but it's moving pretty fast off the bat. Gets it wrong lengthwise. Nawaz, in quick fire fashion, is 20 not out. Very exciting stuff. Sticking with pace on. This is Ratnaikas, he's going to get driven for four. Nice looking shot, Uraman, there's class in this. This one gets past everybody, and this is that extra bounce. In fact, it's taken a little edge along the way, so Rilla can't take a trick at the moment. Another feather, and this is going to be a fortunate boundary, but a boundary nonetheless for Dinner Brescia. They're 34 without loss. This is short and pounded. This has gone all the way. Well, watch out the officials, Ted. That's almost taken some collateral damage. Maximo Nawaz moves to 30. Backs away, chance, and snapped up. Well, Just you like caught that. it perfectly. Samaragi's the man that finds himself in the right spot at the right time. The decision to use that, Nyaka pays immediate dividends. He has the first wicket of the final. Ginna Brescia lose their first, 45 for one. Not a good delivery. That is Gundy, and that one's rocketed to the fence. In fact, it's gone all the way. Maximo! Overcompensates, and now Batter gets lucky again. This is also going to roll to the rope. To think, reflect on our adventures. Well, this is a full toss. It's called no ball, and this is a disaster. Well, that's up the ant hill, and Nawaz goes to 50. Maximo. Okay, this is skied. Now, this is a chance, and it looks like Samra Kun's going to take it, and he's going to drop it. And this guy doesn't drop catches generally, but that's the pressure of the moment. I think he was wondering if nothing Dige was going to come for it. In the end, he was left to do it on his own. And he just doesn't get his hands set, doesn't get his hands in the right position. It bounces off his chest, and that's a big moment in the game. Hassan Ahmed gets dropped. And now, this is going to go past this dump. So I thought he chopped on. Instead, it's going to go for oh. four. This has been hit pretty well. It's an opportunity, and no mistakes at all. The catch has been taken. And, uh, well, this man, he doesn't drop him, does he? Gets himself into good position. And uh, Nathan Adige says, thank you very much. Well, this is blasted out of the ground. And you can forget this. Hassan Ahmed had struggled to get to six, but he doubles his score in style. At Nike goes the journey. Maximo time of his last ball. He'll finish two for 23. Eight overs down to 97. That's the sort of score they got in mind again here. In the air, this should be out. Nathan Adige comes in and he's got such a great pair of hands. And that's travelling. And that's a dangerous player removed. And still, best part of two overs remaining. And it will be Tanvir that departs for two. A wicket to start the ninth. All happening in the ninth. That's per usual. Jinnah Brescia now. 92 for three. Faster. And this is into the gap. This will be four. That's, has to bowl it again. So instead, he has to bowl straight a bit. Nutton Digo. Well, he catches for fun. And he's not going to miss out either. So Hasan Ahmed just never got going in the final, did he? And he hits this one hard enough to go for six. But there's one man guarding that boundary, and that is Nutton Dige. That's his third catch of the final. He's been brilliant. He won't get a bowl. It's an important game. This one could be out. He's got time to race. And oh, he's he missed it. He's missed it. Yeah. Misses it with the ball, but knocks him over with his shoulder. That won't count. You've got to do it with the ball, Sunshine. Yeah, look, credit to the batter because he legs it out. It's very easy to give up on this when you see the, the bowler with the ball, but he at least forces him to throw. I know you might laugh at this. He's not far away, but he's only got one stump to aim at, right? And he's forced to throw, and he misses. This is it, no run. So what a good finish that is. I mean, they, I was questioning Kalagamage if he was the best option. Well, he certainly put me back in my box because he only concedes four off the last over. And Gina Brescia, well, they end up with what I genuinely think is an average total. They have 103. They still have got the 100 on the board. Ramos CC will have to bat well, but also 
Now, Jenna Brashat will have to bowl if they're going to defend it. Good afternoon, Buenos Aires, and welcome back to the Roma Cricket Ground. Here we go, 104 for Roma CC to win. And it starts with a banked cut shot. Well, that's four. A little bit short, and he gets it over. And look, Maragi, he's had a bit of luck, and sometimes he's made the most of it, sometimes he hasn't. This could have easily gone to the fielder, but he got just enough bat to get it over the man, and that's another boundary. His second in the first over. Samra Kun goes back, and he's going to get four now. So a good start for both openers. Uh-oh, no ball. No ball coming. And this could go to the boundary. It's pulling up, but it's still going to get there. He gets wide. Wow, is history repeating again? This is unbelievable. It'll be, it'll be five wides. I mean, earlier in the game, we had a six off a no ball and then a five wides. Now we had a four off a no ball and a five wides. Nine off this ball, and it hasn't even been bowled yet, Rico. Goes deep in his crease, and he whips it away for six. Well, that one is going to go all the way, I think. Oh, no, it's gone for four. It's too short, not a good delivery. This will be four. Doesn't get the length right here, Janaka, and he's going to have to sort it out quick because this score is motoring up to 39 now. I know what you're coming up with soon. First, Maragi. Watch as this one get away from Hassan. This will be four oh. buys. Oh, this is a full toss. Should go the distance, but I'm not sure it will. Hassan, it won't. Ball into his hands, it goes over his head. One of the tallest guys on the field. Morago goes Maximo. Well, it might be over now because this really should be cool. He's got to find it first, and he will. That's a really good catch by Rizwan Tanvir. Had to just quickly check both ways, make sure there was nothing coming. So Moragi, well, he hits his ceiling again in the 30s, doesn't he? But he has got his team off to a very good start. Roma CC lose their first wicket now. It's 59 for one. Here we go. His rookie. Rookie once more. In the air, and this could go to the field. Well, oh, what a catch! Unbelievable oh, catch! My word. This is probably one of the best catches I've ever seen. When you give the moment, they need something to to go their way. Kalagamage goes to an absolute rip snorter. He's gone for one. Oh. What a catch by Sharuk Nawaz! Oh. Well, this has gone leg side, and this will go the journey. So Samaragi wants the momentum back, and we haven't always seen him doing this over the leg side. But uh, Samaragi could, in fact. Because Samurai, you got the single, of course, but Samurai couldn't. Wow, he spashes this one, and now he becomes even more critical. Maximo. This is smacked, but how far? It's hanging in the air a long time. The fielders go back, and oh, it's going to be another catch. catch. Unbelievable. And that almost seemed deliberate, and I think he's gone back. I don't think he's touched the rope. This we'll is not to... deliberate, I don't think. I'm not so sure. He seems to, for me, he almost seems to bat it away, just trying to keep it in the field to play. Let's have a look. It's all about the feet here. If the feet stay and they don't touch the line, well, let's have a look at it. Well, that's going to be six. Six runs. Oh, oh no, hang, hang on. on. Hang on. You see, as long as the toe's on the ground there, he's re-established himself in the field of play. So I think, and the benefit goes to the fielders in these ones. So I've got a feeling this is going to be out. And I think the message has come. And I think Samaragi's out. In he's fact, out. he is out. He is out. Wow. Tambia. It's in the air, and he gets this to go over the boundary. One bounce, four runs. Can he finish well? Oh, it's a lovely shot. Oh, it's a beautiful shot. Well, this is, this is going to be whipped away, and it's a really good shot from the left hand up. This will be four. And this is an up and over, and this is going to be more runs. This will be four more runs. They're closing in, Rico. Samara Kunmus into the 30s. Ten required for victory. And now he'll whip this one away. How far is this one going? That's going all the way as well. I think it has. Well, we'll wait for the decision, but it's gone all the way. I'm calling it Maximo. Four will do it, and this could do it. It will. Roma CC have come through the clouds, and they are the champions of Italy. The hosts have done it in a boil over. They've won six sudden death matches in a row over the last 
two weeks and they will be going to the ECL in 2023. What a story and what a five weeks. The Italian summer comes to such an exciting conclusion. Romeo CC are the champions. Amazing scenes. The crowd go wild. The players go wild. They storm onto the pitch. Romeo CC are writing history here. Last week, they won their first ever European Cricket Series to make it into the finals of this Super Week. And now here they are. They are the champions. Wow.